Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to play See You once again. We're going to be doing some dates and competitions. There are a few new outfits and of course the winner from last week's competition and a new competition at the end of today's video. So I'm very excited for this one. Before we go into the daily itself, I do have a quick little announcement that I have a Discord server now. This server is dedicated to all fashion games, so it doesn't matter if you play Suyu, Life Makeover, Fashion Dreamer, any other games like Shiny Nikki, Love Nikki, Time Princess, whatever. It is a lot of fun. My favorite part is, as you can see here, the daily dress up prompt. So every day a thread will be opened with a different prompt. I have over 200 prompts lined up for the year. It doesn't matter which game you play, you are totally free to dress up as whatever, but it's really fun to see everyone's designs every day it doesn't matter as you can see it's a life makeover it's see you it's fashion dreamer so if this is something you think you like check out the link down in the description below now of course let's get into the winners of the mythical creature comp i had a lot of entries i really want to say y'all are so creative because i think it was like a really broad thing so you could like really pick and choose what you wanted to do here and a lot of you also even made like a whole story with it i thought it was so cute i loved reading it and i love seeing how original everyone is our first winner chose by my boyfriend is by pony diet it's a beautiful angel and i agree this one is really beautiful he said he really liked the gold and the items just all together and since they are not part like of one whole set i do really think that you incorporate it so well that he even asked if this was a full set so i say this outfit is done very very well i really like it i like i said before i'm not the biggest fan of these wings but i feel like this whole thing just kind of comes together real well it looks very heavenly right i really like it then my pick for this time was why so it's kind of hard to see because of the filter but i do really like filter i wish it just still passed it was a little bit less but you can't change that but as you can see there's a zombie there's a werewolf girl and i think there's like a vampire in the back i really like it i don't think that anyone else had done a zombie and i thought it was pretty creative because it is still i guess a mythical creature and i just like the ambiance i feel like this captures the the prompt really really well so congratulations then our last winner for today is elise she wrote a whole story you should check it out and then the picture is absolutely like amazed it's clear that you put so much work into making this we have four characters one in the background with like an orb and wings and then fairies in the foreground and they all have like their own unique style it's just overall very impressive so congratulations and again if you want to enter for the next competition stay till the end of today's video now let's get into the dailies as you can see i changed my outfit to one of the prompts for the server and it was ballerina off duty so i went kind of with a blue theme so let's start off by liking a few things so you did announce a few new outfits in their post here. I'm really a big fan of this outfit. I think this is supposed to be Marilyn Monroe. I love the little little hand pose. It's very elegant. I also really like the hair and the coat, even though we've had a lot of these feathered puffy white coats, but I don't hate it. I really like it. And then the other one, I think this is supposed to be Twiggy. I don't think I like this one as much, but again, I do I do like the unique pose. So um, we're going to see this is probably going to be the next gacha. So excited to see that come in. All right, let me get all the boring stuff just out of the way by doing the spins. Let's hope we get lucky today with a little bit more gems than usual. At least we got a lot of gold there. Hopefully with our final reward, it's going to be good too. I don't think I have anything to craft right now because there aren't any craftable events going on. I've been crafting so many green ones. I think I'm just going to move on to making these. Look, I have 100 green perfume, so I kind of have to <laughs> move on to the next one, I guess. And let's get the more of these purple ones so I can finish that as well. Now, on to the shop items because they did add some stuff here there's three on the top i'm like 99 sure that this is supposed to be homelander from the boys and this is supposed to be starlight from the boys i did watch the show didn't like it after season two but i okay I, I can appreciate it also can we talk about the guy his reward post is him literally ripping off his shirt <laughs> Okay, and then I don't think Starlight has a reward. And then I'm wondering who the middle character is. I'm not, it doesn't look familiar to me. If anyone knows, please tell me because it's probably reference to something. Also, a quick heads up. If you want to complete this outfit for the reward because she comes with like a little chain she holds, you don't need the hair. I don't know what that is. I saw it on Reddit. But as you can see, you don't need it. I think I will get these items because they really go well for the streetwear or the punk outfit. And I just don't have that many leather items. So I think we're going to get the set today. So let's just do the whole thing how much is that oh it's only 700 okay that's not too bad let's get that and i think we get the reward with it too now look how cute again this will probably do well in the goth comps and stuff i really like the skirt and i'm hoping for recolors for that as well i don't think there's anything new other than that the makeup but it's not 
my cup of tea. And we have a new pack with a seal, which is really cute, and the machine. I really like the backgrounds for this one as well. Now we have quite a lot of competitions to get into, so let's just go straight in. The first one is a long concert. Still an elegant look to join a great long concert and just elegant, no rewards for gems and stuff. So we're gonna go a little bit experimental here or like something different because I don't really need to win on this one. Let's see for elegant dresses first. I wanna try using a dress I don't normally use. So we're gonna of course skip on this one. It's gonna do high rank, okay? We're just here for the fun. I really like this one. I don't think I've used it that much. I also really like this one, but I always... Oh. Okay, I do always use this one in the color, but it matches so perfectly with the background. So I think we're gonna go with this. Uh, let's see, maybe white and silver will go really well with this because there's like silver in the dress here as well. For hair, I have been using this one a lot. I really am happy that I got it. However, they just released recolors for it. I'm just kind of like, mm, about it. Because like, this is too similar. We have gray and we have gray fading into purple, which I do like. It's kind of expensive. And then we have gradient with blue, like... I guess it's because it's like mythical hair, but I would have loved to see like a red, a blonde, you know? I don't know. I'm hoping they add those later. Okay, we're just gonna leave this as now. We'll just do a different hair. Let's check sleeves because for elegant, I feel like you would have something on your arms. All right, I don't really have anything good. So we'll do the nails. Maybe bracelets, two silver bracelets, lots of accessories, but without it being too much, right? But we could do the fan, but I recall it this one. Okay, her arms are floating, but I do like the nails on the other side. Maybe if we add a coat or something, we can hide that a little bit. Ooh, I like that. Is that too weird for a lawn concert if you have all the feathers? I mean, it is kind of naturey, so that's my that's my storyline plot here. Ooh, the eyes close is very pretty. You know what? I never use this one. Let's see if it does well because it does match like the purple bluish tints, right? But I just I'm not the biggest fan of the makeup for the hair. I kind of want to do this one, but again, I want a little bit different here. There's too many cute hairs. <gasps> Wait, the short one. Okay, I again I never really do the short hair that much so let's give this a chance i'm not gonna do unworn reset so it's just whatever oh this is what a chain looks like see it's really cool the coat kind of ruins it here but all right we can't really add background piece so i'm just gonna do the shawl in the back because there's like wind going on right and that's going to be it i'm, I'm happy with that one this was a good little warm-up maybe we can have something more difficult right now next up game center seeking the innocence of your as a typo. In the game city, celebrating the arrival of Children's Day. Chain of rival items, which we just bought, so that's good. And then we should try on this one because the top 15 gets a blue box and gems at 30. All right, so we can just use the full set, I think. This one is honestly the best one for a arcade outfit. I don't know, the chain is so red though. Like, this is not very arcade-like, but whatever. Uh, do we want to do a jacket? It kind of looks weird, maybe. Actually, no. <laughs> We're gonna we got to... Okay, the, the hair got to go with this one all right it's i'll give it like two free passes for today and we'll do the this makeup with the hair i just feel like it's my favorite oh the headphones that is a really good move on this i really like that i think the outfit is already done that was pretty easy because i got the whole thing already and we can do an under handheld actually the cotton candy that kind of fits the color theme and let's do the wings okay come for me i love the the colors it just goes really well together all right i think this is done i'm happy with it i like the blue because it kind of makes the purple pop, right? And then we'll do the plus 15. We can do little stars. That's really cute. Oh, I like that. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, that's really good. Now let's do some votes so we have enough for the two more competitions. Flowers grown by the same riverside bloom on completely different souls. Ooh, I love those because I love doing the contrast outfits myself because even though there's not really like, they're so different, right? There's still like a clear guide on what you have to follow because again, I've said it before. Some of these prompts, they're like too vague and I don't know what's gonna do well but if you have like fire and eyes dark and shadow like the contrast is really easy to make so it's easier for people to get that done i guess i did enter this one but i kind of <laughs> i don't know wait you want to see it i kind of went default okay <laughs> I, I had two of these outfits saved already because i have so many outfits saved so i kind of like put these together it was kind of like dark and ocean but that doesn't really contrast I, just as i was saying that it was really easy to contrast but okay some of these don't really have that same theme so it's okay i guess we'll see how it does. 
Ooh, I like that with the mirror. I think the mirror was from a paid pack, right? And that's probably why I don't have it. Ooh, this is the cozy look. I really like doing that. Wait, I'll also show you that one. I'm happy with that. I would wear this. this is, I mean, what we're wearing right now, right? This is so cute. And I gave her the little plushie and the coat. This thing in blue is so much better than the pink version. I really like it. Oh, this is a different prompt. Oh, it's not. Why are we outside, girl? We gotta stay indoors. Also, I really like the bunny jacket. I bought it a while ago because it costs gems. It's like one of the default items. I haven't even not really used it in any comps because I don't really I don't know the coat kind of covers a lot of hair and it doesn't have like many things going on so it doesn't always do well in comps I think I haven't used it that much I did use it to create an outfit though which was really nice moving on on the podium a woman who has made outstanding contributions to the field of human development will be recognized on the podium so she's like a researcher elegant business lady outfit is formal and we can win gems but it's only top 30 so we can only have to try it a little bit okay formal neck accessory you know what let's choose this one because it's kind of like the basic thing we could also do a scar really kind of ignore the formal for the hair but this one is so good if this one ever comes back and you don't have it i recommend getting it because it's from the christmas set i think all right so she's getting a reward so i want either like a super sleek dress or i want a two-piece because this is like really good this is sophisticated okay i was gonna do a dress but i don't think that's gonna do well at least what the prompt is supposed to be so do a hat i like the hat but you wouldn't really wear one in doors all right we can bend it a little bit how we're gonna do this and we'll do the earrings <gasps> that is gorgeous with the hair i really like that <laughs> i'm such a big fan of these petals but they're too low for me they're supposed to be like a little bit up i don't know what's going on but we'll keep that in her makeup i think is fine but we can change it to the i don't know this one is also pretty i like the lips and let's do one of my uh hoarded uh perfumes on this and that is on its way how fun and our last one is going to be the toughest one 100 gems top 30 and a black box in top 15 and it has to be animal wild and then wild accessories this is going to be so difficult because i'm so bad at these because i don't have any good wild accessories i don't think a lot of people do but ugh, i don't i don't know because i want to go for like the leopard girl but there are just i'm gonna say it there are no good leopard girl items like maybe if we do this and then do black accessories with it how are we feeling on that because i don't have the ears or any of the cool hair pieces and i feel like that kind of puts the whole outfit together maybe the face mask like, make her look with mysterious i really want like some sort of big hair going on i was almost <laughs> i want to say this one again if we had this in a brown recolor where is it you know what this one is also really good and then for the rest of the outfit i just want plain black Ooh, oh you know what? I kind of like the bodysuit because the necklace kind of drapes over and it makes it look really interesting and we can still add a coat. The question is, which one if we did? Oh, I kind of like that. Is that weird? It's not really animal-like anymore if I do that, but you know what? Let's take a risk. I really like the gold, okay? And I do have these ears, which is like the best I can do besides like bunny ears or something, but I mean, it can be an animal, but I think I want to go for the cat route because then we can also add the tail and I think we're good. I think we are good like this. I don't think i've ever made a look that looks like this so let me try and dress this up a little bit without changing the background at all all right what do we think i really like using the frame to like kind of divide the picture because i don't want to change the background because i feel like that's like a no-go in these kind of things i almost forgot we should probably reset something and we'll just use a plus 15 i don't need to get crazy numbers on this but i need to get up there okay so if you see it please vote because i want to know what's in the box let's see and that's going to be it oh that was so fun i like these ones a lot today now it's time for our our new week's competition and today's theme is going to be ballroom i have not done one like this and we have a lot of gorgeous big gowns in here and i want to do something big and glamorous so that's what we're gonna do today so create a room for going to a big ball there are a lot of dresses that i really want to use in this but <laughs> It's either going to be this one or it's going to be this one. I really like both. I don't have any recolors for the bell dress though. I, I do have the blue version of this. So I think I'm going to go with this because I want to be a little bit original because last time the Medusa one was really nice, but I basically used the whole set and we got we to gotta be a little bit more creative here today, okay? So no, no to this hair. Also no to this hair. No to this hair. I'll be strong. Oh, this is look, it looks really good, okay? It looks good. We're going to be original because also I always use these two together if I use this dress in a comp 
comb. Ugh, I need to stray away from my default hairs. I think we're gonna go with this. Go for like an icy, icy queen or something like that. I don't know. Is that cute? Is that weird? If I do the jacket, I'm such a sucker for good sleeves. I don't know what it is. Maybe we should check if we have those first before I move on. Because I feel like the arms are too naked if I don't put it on. Does anyone else have that or is that just like a me issue? All right, it's either the simple white ones or it's this one with the pattern. So I think I'm gonna go for the patterned one because I just think it's cooler. Necklace, it's gotta be, it's gotta be big. It's gotta be bold. Another snake though. I feel like this one will be really great in, okay. <laughs> I was about to say in white, it better be cheap. It is, okay, perfect. I don't mind spending the other things because I got plenty of those, but the other ones are so hard to come by. I never spent them. That necklace is way better in white. Holy. I want to do this one because the crowns are not that good in this game. I feel like this one's kind of like a tiara vibe. So that's really good. And for earrings, I want to do studs. Oh, actually, no, 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 no. This this matches. This matches. Okay, we got to go in. Shoes and socks don't really matter since everything is hidden underneath. We could do the staff, but I'm going to not go for like a princess fairy theme. It's just going to be like ballroom princess. I do kind of like this thingy though, but does it look weird? Maybe. We'll just add on more accessories. I'm just debating. I think we should change her makeup. I really like this one though. I don't really like the accessories on it. It's difficult. I think I'm just gonna go for my default makeup again. <laughs> it's kind of lame, but I do think it suits her, you know? I'm feeling kind of bold, so maybe we should do two color outfits. So for the other one, I want to use a different color dress. So it's going to be blue and brown, which is not a color combination I've ever used. I will do a different kind of hair. Or should we do black hair then all right on my defense the only good black hair is this one or this one <laughs> so i kind of want to go for a really long one and the accessory will keep the crown the same but we'll do different either pearl silver like accessories or we gotta have like a better oh the hair accessory is really cute all right that's perfect and all we have to change is her makeup all right i just have to make a new one because i really like the snake one but the snake skin doesn't really work with everything okay so let's just buy this real quick and now Ta -da! Oh, she's so cute. I love it. Now to put the whole thing together. I think I'm gonna buy it. Okay, I think I'm gonna commit. I did it. I just need to commit sometimes to buying these backgrounds because they're so hard to get either way. So might as well just spend gems on them once in a while. I'm not really sure where I'm going with the background decorations. I think I'm just gonna slap on as many <laughs> sparkles as usual. All right, not me buying a background just so I can hide most of it. But okay, it does look like a ballroom scene. Maybe I should move down the frame a little bit. Right? Right. I like it. I'm a fan, okay? Let's call it the ballroom challenge. All you have to do is create a look for a ballroom and three winners once again will be chosen and shown in next week's daily video. Make sure you link your submission in the comments of this post. Before we end today's video, I do have another event I forgot to check out. It's the makeover staff Lucy. So I assume this is one of the real staff people and she's ready for a makeover. And these are the items we can get. Honestly, I I really like the pants, I think. Yeah, the pants are cute. And I also really like the hair. So I'm excited to get those. And I'll just have to go collect those from the feed. I like doing these so I can see a little bit more outfits. Also, the pixel art is kind of cute. Once again, don't forget to check out the Discord in the description down below. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing or becoming a member. I play a lot of fashion games on this channel. Also, I'm live every Saturday here on YouTube. Let me know down below what you thought of today's video. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.